Just when we thought Yellowstone's geological drama couldn't get any more intense officials dropped a bombshell. The park has experienced hundreds of earthquakes in the past months, and many geologists are terrified of the impending implications. The latest warning from the United States Geological Survey is absolutely terrifying. Specifically, in the last month, seismologists have documented more than 1,000 minor earthquakes shaking the ground beneath Yellowstone. Given the park's volatile history and the unpredictability of its big supervolcano, this is a major cause for alarm, and this announcement has put the world of science on high alert. Are we on the brink of disaster? Could this seismic frenzy signal the awakening of the supervolcano lurking beneath Yellowstone's surface? Join us as we delve into the heart of this seismic storm and uncover the truth of Yellowstone. Official gives serious warning after hundreds of earthquakes hit the national park. Yellowstone needs no introduction regarding its highly diverse and dynamic geothermal activities and hydrothermal features, which make it the most fascinating park in the United States. It pulsates with life, continuously reshaping itself through these processes. This perspective reflects the boundless nature of life around us, but not to get carried away, our primary focus lies in the scientific and geographical past events that reformed Yellowstone into what we have today. Yellowstone National Park encompasses a vast expanse of land measuring 2.2 million acres, covering parts of Wyoming, Montana, and Idaho. Various wild animals are found within its expanses, including the pronghorn, coyotes, wolves, and American bison. Despite its reputation as a potential ticking time bomb due to underground turmoil, Yellowstone's beauty draws photographers worldwide, seeking the perfect shot amidst the subsurface chaos. Long before it was designated as a national park, Yellowstone was the residence of many Native American tribes, including the Crow, Shoshone, and Blackfeet. These tribes not only settled down in the land but also held it sacred. However, the majority of their history is speculation accompanied by myths, stories, and legends because the region's turbulent past destroyed many facts. Regardless, the fact that they inhabited the scene and took care of its surroundings is an opportunity to discover the beautiful heritage Miracles Yellowstone is famous for. Nevertheless, there are those who are under the impression that the souls of the tribes are still present in the wilderness of Yellowstone. In the 18th century, the Ottawa region did not exist in the minds of the Euro-American settlers unless you were either a Native American or an explorer. Strangely, it was recorded that Europeans sailed into these regions in the late 18th century. Records indicate that the Lewis and Clark expedition from 1804 to 1806 played a crucial role in mapping these territories. The frontier scientist Lewis led his group north to explore the Marias River, but Clark, the soldier mapmaker, and self-taught physician led his group southeast to explore the Yellowstone area. Although the expedition did not directly explore Yellowstone, it laid the groundwork for future exploration. Decades later, in 1869, a group of non-Native Americans led by David E. Folsom conducted the first documented trip into what is known as Yellowstone today. It was the first to record its natural beauty. Although it was modest in scope, this expedition set the stage for the beginning of the Pacific to European exploration. After that, more expeditions, including the washburn langford Doan expedition of 1870, were launched in succession. The most significant undertaking in the region is the exploratory project of the Hayden Geological Survey in 1871, organized by geologist Ferdinand Hayden, sponsored by the federal government. The expedition not only explored the region but also had the task of carefully and correctly recording the details of Yellowstone's beauty. During the mission, Hayden and his team, including artists, scientists, and photographers, spent a few months examining and mapping the region. This was the natural starting point for future scientific endeavors and exploration. Their records established the first artistic depiction of Yellowstone's landscape. At the end of the 18th century, the conclusions from their explorations became the basis for its official designation as the first national park in the world on March 1, 1872. Despite all that has been said about Yellowstone Park, one might question, isn't Yellowstone just like any other park in the United States? Well, it's not. Besides its excellent scenery, extravagant wildlife, and imposing human essence, it is famous, among other things, for its great thermal features. These features include hot springs, mud pots, geysers, and many more. 
Among these wonders is one of the world's most renowned geysers, Old Faithful. As a symbol of Yellowstone's beauty, Old Faithful erupts with a faithful rhythm of 60 to 90 minutes, sometimes ejecting more than 8,000 gallons of water upward. It has been reported that historically, the Old Faithful drain would spurt 185 feet into the sky, an absolutely stunning spectacle of nature's mighty power. These unprecedented scenes leave no room for doubt about the park's unrivaled originality. No other word can better describe the majesty of these geological wonders than Yellowstone. As people revere it upon seeing it in person, but wait, there's more. Did you know that beneath the geysers, pools, and waterfalls, Yellowstone also conceals one of the largest volcanic systems on the planet? The Yellowstone caldera is among the largest volcanic systems worldwide, hosting a tremendous magma reservoir beneath its surface. This system is responsible for creating extensive thermal features scattered throughout the park. Besides, the park's thin Earth's crust makes it the center of the universe of geologists worldwide, who dedicate their lives to understanding the complicated relations between different geological bodies. Dr. Robert Smith and fellow scientists, including Dr. Lisa Morgan and Dr. Mike Poland, conduct extensive research on earthquakes and volcanic processes in Yellowstone. They view the park as a valuable field laboratory for geographical analysis and recognize its significance on an international scale. However, to some, their perception of Yellowstone as a laboratory may seem exaggerated, especially considering the constant tremors and risks present. Safety concerns such as rocks, landslides, faults, or cracks during earthquakes pose significant challenges, limiting exploration of the area for most people. This underscores the bravery and dedication of scientists and park personnel who work tirelessly to mitigate the impact of earthquakes, which are frequent in the region. Yellowstone is often associated with catastrophic events due to its high seismic activity. Did you know that over 1,000 seismic activities occur in Yellowstone each year? This staggering number highlights the substantial seismic activity in the region. Given the frequency of earthquakes in Yellowstone, some may advocate for completely sealing off the environment to safeguard human lives. However, such extreme measures have not been deemed necessary. Earthquakes are natural phenomena inherent to the park, and their magnitude and consequences vary greatly, making it challenging to predict their specific impact. While some earthquakes may cause significant changes in natural phenomena and infrastructure damage, others may only result in minor underground tremors that go unnoticed. Therefore, a balanced approach is essential, recognizing the natural processes at play while prioritizing safety measures to mitigate potential risks.